Yeah, we were always BJ's oh, people because uh, there are Costco certain far away. There are just in hella far certain away. areas of the country that I wish I could move everywhere. Like Philly needs a Costco. You know what? Philly needs a. You cookout. know what? This whole goddamn South Carolina needs a Checkers. You know what? This whole goddamn coast needs a cookout. This cookout. Cookout needs to be in this whole goddamn country. Bug. But if I if we if we a got a water burger to this damn coast. Like, people talk about, like, how good In-N-Out, like, In-N-Out is, like, West Coast, Five Guys, whatever. People don't talk about Whataburger, and, like, it's criminal. It's a Whataburger is just, like, I got a the dream constant dream. That I'm going to one day put a cookout on the corner of 15th and Cecil B. If you did that. It will, it's dude, going to murder You know what I was thinking? Okay, if they put a, if they put a. It, it ruined, like. Yeah, like, it is suck. If they put a no one knows Wawa. What cookout is. On like Temple Cecil being 15, it would make so much Yo, we goddamn the, money. We Do you know how many drunk there. kids are in goddamn Temple Town oh. that would kill for a damn Wawa? <laughs> that would be like I would go there so much. I would walk like four god like I would like walk so far for my drunk ass to get like a goddamn hoagie. You feel that? So, uh, if you don't know, my name is GL. Okay, fucking money. Uh, no, you're supposed to be dot com. I'm oh, sorry, I'm dot com. This guy me? sucks. Can I get new talent? Sorry, I don't really like fun uh, <laughs> or um, impersonations. So, I think this is a butt oh, check. I don't know if this is illegal, but no, they. Nope, no, this seems to be a. No. They're, they're All right, no, 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 oh, no, no, no. Unless <laughs> <laughs> <I'm not> Mario's <laughs> a man, fucking listen, idiot. I will say, uh, well, like, playing Chris is really, 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 really strange. I would um, say he's definitely the most interesting PM Bowser I've ever played. Ever I played, played like ever odds. Played. I played like American yeah. Bowser. I played, I played all of them. I want to say I played, I, I played good BJ. I played the Narwhals. Every time I think he's going to do something, nothing is done. No. Nope. And then every time I think nothing will be done, something is done. Super unique like, style. I'll be technical too. Yeah. He prides himself like on, like I well, I pride him on his mix ups. Yeah. I think his mix ups are insane. And he, he's definitely like a, a supreme wizard with Bowser tech. There's some ledge stuff that he does. Like I think media. Bowser suits the way he plays Smash well. If that makes sense. Yeah. I think like platforms like he lo hey like look at him on platforms right now. Like a it's immaculate. It's, yo, it's, it's so music. Look at that instant get up, dog. Mm -hmm. That to like dash attack. Oh my god. Like that fair backer and nutty. It makes Bowser uh, look like like something I want to do. It makes him look so fast, and this is why I would never advocate anybody. I mean, but you have to remember, like particular when you walk, when you look at a Bowser. Be fast, right? When like you do it, you have to remember he's being fast in a very certain range. It's like almost like the illusion of speed. Like when you get down to it, Bowser's still like a horrendously slow, slow character is, with yeah. all his aerials coming out super late compared to like the rest of like the Project M cast. And like that's, that's like the back, like the, the biggest fundamental issue. I can't believe he grabbed that goddamn ledge. That was some wizard shit. Theater cancer. Like what doesn't he have? Like oh my god. Uh, Instant ledge trap with side view? Like, how do you, who learns uh, that? Avari is a god, by the way. Like, Avari is also a god, and I'm gay fucking money, but we like. We're talking about Chris for a while. Avari is our third ring player in Philly. He hasn't been given the opportunity to come to these recently because we switched from um, Wednesdays to Thursdays. So it's really refreshing yeah. to see him out here. I'm, I'm gonna throw some shade at Tebow. Why didn't you tell us between semesters you were switching the date? It wasn't his fault, man. I literally like, like a, made my schedule about how easy it would be to go to Clash on Thursdays, and then you made it so hard for me to go to Clash. Okay. Next semester, though, I'll be all over it. Don't worry. Don't worry, Cheebs. X. So I think... Uh, I think if we don't go start... I think... Trimon's a starter here? Okay. Um... Yeah, absolutely. There's no way he's not gonna ban. There is an argument to be had there because there are still some uh, PNK. I think Vari's gonna ban. Don't really argue on that fifth uh, mm -hmm. neutral. Uh, I've seen some people use Bowser Castles. Uh, some people like Delphinos, but I think. I mean, personally speaking, obviously, if you ever talk to me or ever play this game with me ever, you know that like. Generally speaking, yeah, I am like one of the most conservative stage-wise, like PM. But I think like I'm think basically like only? a goddamn extreme. Like no, I think <laughs> I think these five stages, if these were the only stages in PM. Yeah. This game would be so much better. <laughs> like, fuck Wario Land, fuck the the Dufinos, man, fuck any of those counter right. picks. I don't even like FD in this game. So Chris had the first stage strike right there. So what he definitely been? left. Uh, he went. He struck Dreamland. So that's I interesting. That he wants to. I think he was like aiming for like a, a Delfinos or a Battlefield situation. Yeah, that's why he banned Dreamland. But right. then he kind of has to settle, and I would hate this because of this exact reason. Yeah, I would not like Green Hills. Did he just jab with reset with, with Fireball? Fire. That was fuego as shit. Literally. Man, it's showing that he still got it in that bag. Perfect Shield's coming what out left and right. Two, two this is three? like... This, 
This, this is wizard shit. This will be the shit. sexiest button check oh I've ever seen in my God. life. Like, it's not even too far off because there's so many crazy things coming out. Jabri set him with the fireball. Three power shields in a the row. Fireball back to him. Getting that armor on that. Bodacious. Attack, like, that was a pretty ballsy dash yeah. attack. I don't know why I went for that. Very, very bold. Up air. Forward smash? Uh, maybe if you angle uh, it down, okay. but still. Done stop. The angle on that back air is uh, it's really disgusting. Shots it's 47. Like, it's like a backer facing sheet fair, if you will, almost at that semi spike angle. So the chances of you making it back after you've blown that jump, getting hit by that barrel stage, slim to dissolve. Did you see that clown fiesta free 35%? And I feel like if you just like went for a, a follow up after like he has like the 28% mark, like look what the look at this. Yeah, this is nutty. Incredible. It's just like because it's Mario combos versus a character as heavy as Bowser. I mean, it's that's just like Mario versus Bowser in particular, dog. This should be horrible. I think like that's. Can't had a hero I think that's story like, getting usurped by the king of the evil. I, I think right. yeah. But I think that's, like, the biggest problem with Bowser. Like, yeah, you can, like, do, like, fancy tech shit and, like, make the illusion of speed all you want. But in the, the actuality, you're just going to get bopped nine times out of ten. Maybe. He's got some heavy punishes in this store, and that's what Chris is going to need to make use of. He wants to bring this back down 163 to 34%, but that bear will clean that stock up right there. Var is doing a great job of chasing down the, these techs from Chris. He's running through with, like, up airs and dash attacks on the other side of him so that even if he does miss, he get the opportunity to, like, position himself behind him, which is, like, it's, it's really crucial right here because Bowser can't cover his back well. Once you get behind Bowser, you kind of have the easy pickings, if you will, of, like, choosing an option. I mean, what is he going to do? Throw better, out a back air? Yeah, even like, his good-ish his good -ish options face forward. Mm, trying to get that bear right I there. I think, Not honestly, what he should have done was help that ledge and re-grab instead of going for a back air because, like, that was, like, such an obvious sweet spot. Up, up, forward, looking like a Konami pole at its finest. And that Nair again. Bari loves that Nair. Yeah, Bari is a big Nair player. Nair, fair, and uh, down throw follow ups. I think it's like a, a Mario thing, but especially a Mario yeah, thing. Yeah, thing. He'll Nair through your tech. He'll dash attack after the Nair on your tech. trying to pop you back up. Um, he's doing a really good job right now. Keeping Chris off of his feet. Putting that first knock up accident right there. He's probably going for a fireball, but we take those. Yeah. Another Nair? No. no. He left the ground right there. 49% attack on right quick. Set. Oh, such a Down smash? <laughs> oh, going for a ballsy fair. And this is exactly what needed. He gives an opportunity to regrain uh, that stage position, but back out again after only piling on 16%. Not looking the best uh, on this match. All right. Oh. Power These power shields are kind of nutty. I've been thinking them. See, like he just kind of jumped off the stage with Nair, like. Oh, okay, okay. Sour spot oh, back here to the sweet spot. Shot that, attack. okay, all right. Definitely cleaning that stock up. Chris, stuff. Chris cleaned it up with that a little bit. It was really clean, man. Great use to show that. Uh, I, I don't think I've ever seen a, a Bowser Bear Edge guard, guard like that yeah. clean. It was a sour spot to the sweet spot. Mm -hmm. Immediately grabbing the ledge. That was just so sick. Um, but we've already taken that first stock. He kind of got off to the hot start right there, so I think that's maybe why. Can you put, like, number one? Yeah, I got and, it. Um, that was oh, some other loser. No, back. Back. Yeah, we Chibo's good. got it. Chibo's got it. We good. I can't walk. We good, man. Hey, Chibo, nothing happened. Nothing. Nothing at all. Literally nothing. So I definitely think Depths wants some closed quarters here. Bari had the opportunity to kind of space himself and pace himself that match with so much space being on the stage. Did he FOD? It seems like FOD and Wario Land would be the two choices that he definitely got. Uh, I would go probably Green, Green Hill or maybe Battlefield for Green Hill for is such a good Mario stage that it's kind of like a... If That's what I'm saying. I was, I was, I would have gone for Battlefield just because of like Bowser movement and like not fighting Mario and Green No, this, this is my man's dog. Let me... Sh let me show you what it's about, dog. This is a Bowser that's been doing it for quite a bit of time. Not man has been a name in the community since the 3.02 days. Really? So uh, he definitely, if nothing else, has the acumen. <gasps> oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Because he just, I know I was talking shit on this counter pick, but he just got the goddamn, man. like, some Reddit shit right there. He is looking incredibly money right now with these tech and movement options. So Cash is Bowser. fucked, Chris Rodriguez. Well, he's so cognizant of that cape, too. That means, like, just the matchup experience that he's inundated already has in his brain. Like, the way he's recovering is so particular. And at first, you would think, like, it looks funny. Why isn't he going straight to the ledge? He knows Mario has that sham wow. He's waiting to pull that joint out, get the clean stop off of yeah. him. So, really uh, smart fading. Billy and now he's eat your heart out, fam. He's trying his best to, like, capitalize on the lead he has. He's, like, making his approaches as safe as a Bowser really can be. Yo. 
<laughs> the the hitbox on that we down there, there was like nope. everything he needed. It was so interesting the way he used it right at the corners to bring uh, Vari down. I like how Vari went for like this balls to the wall like forward air, gets him back on the ground, and then completely misses like every follow up. <laughs> Mario but he, he got the stock now. So. Swinging at the fences, 68%. Is this going to be the stock? That almost killed. Grab ledge, back oh, air. Has double jump Yo, these back bears air from, from ledge, ledge are kind of nutty. Stuff. I, it makes me like not want to play against them. We got, got seven rings in hand. It's kind of seem like, especially the way Vari, uh, the way he won that last game, it's kind of sort of through disrespect. He didn't necessarily respect the tech options that Chris had, so he was just running through, like I said, with those nares, those dash attacks. Um, and now he's getting the goddamn word. Yeah, he getting work, dog. Rudy's got the chalk, 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 Yo, I remember nothing about chalk zone except for I feel like at some point they went Rudy. Rudy's got the chalk. I kind of remember the theme song. Chalk, and they go chalk, 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 chalk zone. The chalk zone has been returned. Looking like two people in it right now. That combo from Var was absolutely crazy. All right, if this, if these two guys are like the actual cast of Chalk Zone, <laughs> who would be Rudy and who'd be the other guy? Well, I mean, he's in blue right now, so, so I, I guess that makes know. him the other guy by default. <sighs> All right, getting the armor off with that Nair, just waiting for the opportunity he needed to Vari go for uh, an attack that wouldn't send him that far. And that's kind of what you need to know when Bowser has the percent and the capacity to uh, counterattack you real quick, if you will. Sort of like a parry, if you will, kind of like Luigi's Nair also, too. If you move in like butter, you're looking real smooth, that butter knife will clean that ass up. The cut you. Look at he got cut right there, so... Uh, Vari is definitely going to have to respect Chris's option right now. Honestly, after game one, I, I wasn't too confident in Chris doing it, but that was a really solid two stock. It was really the way the game one started. Yeah. Um, Vari just got off on a hot streak, looking like he was right back in it. But um, Chris seemed to buckle himself down very well. And that's what I was this talking is about. First, like, this he has is a lot of tournament experience. This is uh, um, Vari's first, first clash in a while, in right? Quite a while. Because Vari like and I both have class conflict. Or before that, uh, maybe even before that, we haven't had the opportunity to see him in a while since. Kind of sort of season one, uh, Philly PM, if you will. So an old season classic one. looking like he's up against a hard wall right here. Give him some stages that he needs to take. Yeah, Woody, if you're watching this, I hate you. Yeah, you suck. <laughs> Chivo, do you have any message for Woody? Do you have any messages for Woody I can deliver? And already starting off back against the ledge. Okay, so um, Chivo said something along the lines of, Woody, you are a degenerate ingrate. Where the fuck you oh. at? Where is my money, oh. bitch? Oh. I will fuck you up right. in any matchup. I am the goddamn king. And Vari is saying, all right, that game two was a fluke. Watch me get this young Showing some stuff, combos. Bro. I'm on PS2. I will grab you all I fucking want. He's making better use of his finishes as well. The way he ends these combos um, against them. First time uh, in, the, in the second game, we kind of saw him go for up airs, if you will, after uh, he found an opening right there. Uh, he went for the up smash immediately just to give himself a nice position and walking up to him, just disrespecting his wake-up options, putting that shield out there, saying, if you're going to get up, I got something for a dead-ass fan. We'll see if uh, Death can make bring this back because uh, Bowser does have the kill power off the top very quickly here. Does Chris have a... Um like a secondary or a side character at all? Uh, he does, but it's, it'd be disrespected as Bowser. You know what I mean? Like, okay. That's the way he feels about it. Like I'm not. No, that's I reasonable. That's reason. That's like totally says, reasonable. You know I mean? I'm like, just curious. This is my character. I'm going to play it the way I want. I'm going to show you all that Bowser is a threat. Looking like a not much of a threat right now. But that air armor from the ledge, opening up. Get you to that platform. The that wave was, land. That was kind of sick. sick I think if that happened to me in bracket, I'd be shook. Like, right, yeah, I'd be like, oh, what? I'd be like, what do I do oh, now? Oh, okay. He got my reese. He knows my heart. He got the legend. He's getting that. Oh, okay. Really nice awareness in fear of like the sweet spot sour spot bear or the. Not even the bear right He got. He turned out a really smart down there. He's in a really bad situation right now. Giving him a taste of his own medicine. Bear from ledge. You know, twenty-two percent on. Ari's in the driver's seat. Barry's playing really patiently. Basically, all he's doing is waiting for Chris to overextend. Get the and, grab. Like, not even really percent. making his own approaches. Then he just goes in because it's Mario Bowser. Chris holding down right there. Crouch canceling. Uh, getting knocked into the ground off of that hit right there. Find himself even more percent tacked on. He's going to have to come back really hard if he wants to take this victory right now. With the great reads, but uh, almost too much patience in the scent. He's not throwing out his attacks at the time that uh, Vari's going to be there. Just waiting to see if he's going to be mixing up with these dash uh, ranges. Mm. Tries to hit him with the sour spot of that bear to maybe finish up that sweet that spot. Kill? Sour spot of kid. 
but 141 percent. I mean, this is still pretty perfectly heavy. doable, but Varius kind of had like the number the whole game. Yeah, the thing is, like like you said earlier, like Bowser is one of those heavier characters where he doesn't really care too much about when he gets at higher percent, other than what move is necessarily going to kill, kill him. him. You get something easy. Um, he's at a comfortable percent right now. If you combo him, you know, fine. You combo in the Bowser at, at 148 already and get these uh, movement reads off really well right now. Just position himself in a situation Ooh, this where this is going to hurt him. Mari cannot punish. Unless he can recover. Nice sweet spot to ledge. That was no, a really he, smart recovery. He's really good recovery, at using that, that side B to stall himself out. And it also covers himself with a hitbox real quick. He's trying to get the barrel. I think that's just what you're coming. saying. Like even though like Bowser shouldn't, you know, be doing that well he's in that doing, situation, yeah, he's, when he's not getting comboed, he's was sitting back, waiting back, and waiting for his own opportunity. Alvari is just trying to get that kill. Yeah, that's all he wants. He want to kill and grab. Mm -hmm. and Chris is using every tool in his uh. His yeah, he wants to win. See, the thing is, a horrifying thing about playing Bowser is like your fastest aerial isn't safe on Shield. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. The hitbox right there. He thought. And oh, just all right. We got we got a last game, uh, last stock situation. No, he's not into a situation where he can. Oh, oh he's off stage. That jump, he's capable. But he has his jump. He's gonna knock uh, out the ledge. Not grabbing the no. ledge. Sorry, he takes he it. We was talking about that joint all set, and just when he jumped up above, trying. I was to get gonna like KP got all set. I think too. It actually, was I think I have a set to play. I'm not. That's it. All right. Oh, gotcha. Mars. 